Legends. You see them still up, whereas from the side of Onyx Esports, they've actually allowed Evos to take it all. So even without all the ultimates popped off, Evos still able to get this, but the Feather, Airstrike, no, the Circling Ego! Comes in, Taz as well with Wade the Dragon onto Sans. Kyrie helping him out, getting a one-for-one -one trade. It's too much of a good idea, right? Five seconds left on the clock for the next turtle, and they're not going to have both of those ultimates, but here we go. Phantom Execution to the back line. Sam going to be chunked there. That's going to be a knockup coming in. Kyrie onto the back lines as well. Onto Dream. Has to have the wave, but look at Suk to Jin. Able to dish out so much damage as Kyrie goes in for the damage as well. So to Jin running away, has no mana. CW zoned out. Jin hate winning those team fights. Looking at the rotations here, five men is already in the top side. Four out of Onyx Esports, so of course they are going to contest. Meanwhile, Evos, they are also ready with five, and it seems like resources wise, all ultimates are in the board, except for that Tempest of Blade. Let's see. Both retributions up as well, but Onyx Esports have the better setups. So Sujin jumps in and he secures the pickoff happening by Taz. The mechanics, man, shining through for both of the teams. As in the top side, Clover gets a solo kill on his signature hero. So Sujin wants to go for the counter jungle. Kyrie has a retribution. Again, it's going to be the battle as Kyrie is not going to be able to do anything instantly. Sans going back to the tier 2 turret. But the airstrike popped in, but it's going to be Samo who takes a lot of damage, even taken down by Sutsu Jin, who is rotations as they're looking towards this top side. CW doesn't have to go away. He will pop it though, there you go, but Clover gets every single weakness point. CW taken out. Turtle first. Sutsu Jin already in the area. Let's see what they can do. Kaz has the go away. Finch Boy is popped in by Kyrie as Pendragon is poking him slowly. Evos don't want to go for this just yet, and that's going to be a kill actually over. Clover way too aggressive, and now it's a disaster. Green falling down as well to the hands of CW. Tempest of Blaze pop in. And you can see Boots already pressuring that bottom side. It may force Pendragon to deal with it as they are starting to set up for this Lord. Look at Kyrie though. Circling Eagle popped in onto him. Samo going to get kicked, and that's the crossbow tank over onto Kyrie. Forcing the Tempest of Blades. Kyrie getting the defiant contribution. Takes it. Feather airstrike popped in over to zone dreams and clover because has the flicker. He doesn't choose to go in just yet, but with that first lord, it's pretty valuable right now. Skyrie jumped in all the way, able to pick up a shutdown on the Sutsu Jin out of nowhere, assassinating the enemy assassin. That's in the top lane. Clover has shoved it in. This is scary, right? All three lanes are going to be pushing. You can see that Esmeralda already pushing in that bottom side. On an esports, does have the high ground, however, if it is not cancelled by Evil's Legends. Right now, it is just going to be a base turret traded in. Paquito, though, boots. Oh no, he's all alone. He's forced to use that flicker and he might actually be taken down. But Numenon Blast now popped in by Samo as he's not going to be able to pop it all the way. Kyrie jumps in onto Taz, able to find the kill, jumps all around. And he gets out, jumping again one more time onto Pendragon. Onyx Esports are able to find a kill. Another stun over to Pendragon, who's still able to sustain right now as Boots jumps in once again. CW over the counter attack for Onyx Esports. They have a one-man advantage. Samo has the flicker, goes in for the Pendragon, goes in for the Divine Blade. Kyrie able to zone the members away for the rest of Onyx to take the turret. Clover looking for one more. CW. Just going, but CW melts him down. Go away, prevents the Circling Eagle from connecting. Kyrie, a British situation taking Clover down, and this is what I mentioned. Without Clover, very difficult for Evo's legend. Ten Dragon, all alone, one v four, one v five, everything pop. Three, oh, not that much it means. Onyx Esports still has a chance to turn the game around. Evo's legend stuff, they need to reclaim their control by again targeting Sans and as well as CW. Let's Sans see. taken low. It's gonna be him flickering out to safety. Kyrie backing. Well, going back and forth, so to Jin, able to dodge away from the Luminon Blast. And that's going to be Kyrie picking up a kill onto Taz somehow. 2,000 gold lead, an enhanced sword on the top side, marching to the base. Onyx Esports looking for a siege into the inhibitor turret in that mid side. For the airstrike opened up. Luminon Blast as well. Taz able to use the Chunpu to get out. Very good wave manipulation by Onyx Esports. Phantom Execution though, onto the back line. So Jin caught awesome. with a go away by CW, but look at the falling sign. We're able to find him. Kyrie gonna be knocked back into the base. Has any mortality. He bought it last second. He doesn't have time to go oh. for the touch it, but he doesn't need it. He uses the Temple of the Blades and the Pinch Boys to get out. CW caught. So Jin not able to take him down. 
Onyx Esports are able to back off that timing from Kyrie with the immortality. Those boots jumped in all the way onto Pendragon, losing his life, but it's gonna be traded in for Taz. Numenon blast again by Sam as he flickers forward, finding Clover and Pen. Sans has the winner truncheon, able to get out from that position. Sans taken down. Samo with immortality as well. But look who's Blade. here. Kyrie comes in, but it's not oh. enough. Evo have defended. Oh my god. One HP on the base, and it's a wipeout for Evo. Huge miscalculation for a game. Oh, I don't think they can end the game. Three seconds, they might actually be able to. Clover's inspired oh coming god. up. Phantom execution into the base. Boots, That's boots, gonna boots. be coming in. Boots with the knockoff strike. He needs to go for it. He's able to defend for now, but Clover. Oh my god.